this video we will be studying about the prime and composite numbers see prime numbers are the numbers that have only two factors that is 1 and itself let's for example let's say 2 2 is a prime number because it has only two factors 1 and 2 3 is a prime number because it has only two factors 1 and 3 the number 1 and itself then 4 4 is not a prime number because 4 has a factor 1 2 and 4 5 5 is a prime number that is 1 and 5 then 6 is not a prime number because 6 is divisible by 3 6 is divisible by 2 so 6 has more than two factors from 1 and itself that is 2 and 3 7 is a prime number then if i say 9 9 is again not a prime number 10 is not a prime number 11 is a prime number 13 is a prime number then 17 is a prime number then 19 is a prime number so with this we can find out the prime numbers so before 100 i'm writing all the prime numbers here before 100 less than 100 all the prime numbers are 23 then 29 is a prime number then 31 is a prime number 37 is a prime number 41 43 47 then 53 is a prime number because it's not divided it does not come in any numbers table 67 is a prime number 61 is a prime number 71 is a prime number 73 is a prime number 79 is a prime number then 83 is a prime number 89 is a prime number then 97 is a prime number 101 is a prime number so these all are prime numbers because these does not come in any anyone's table and their factors are only one and the number itself composite numbers see composite numbers are the numbers which have more than two factors for example if i take six so six has a factor one two three and six apart from one in itself it has two more factors that is two and three if i take eight so one 2, 4 and 8. Again, apart from 1 and 8, it has two more factors. Right? If I take uh, like 50. Let's say I take 51. So it has factors 1, 3. Right? And it is uh, divided by 51. So these are the factors more than two factors it has so composite numbers have more than two factors and one more important thing one is neither prime nor composite it is a unique number it is a unique number because 1 is the factor of all numbers, so it is a unique number. Then 2 is the only even prime number. Then 2 is the smallest prime number. Then smallest odd prime number is 3 
not one because one is a unique number not a prime or composite number so the smallest e even prime number is 2 or the smallest prime number is also 2 express the following as the sum of two odd prime numbers you have to express these as a sum of two odd prime numbers see 41 can be 41 plus 3 where 41 is also a prime odd prime number and 3 is also odd prime number or you can write it as 23 plus 11 where 23 is also odd prime number and 11 is also odd prime number 36 if you need to express in two odd prime numbers you can express it as 31 plus 3 right or you can also express it as 13 plus 23 because these are all odd prime numbers so you can express these numbers in the form of two odd prime numbers so i hope you have understood the prime numbers and composite numbers do download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us.